Our objective is simple. Complete Enchanted Arms main story and side quests without any deaths. Only five rules that we have for this challenge. That the run is over if any of the main characters die during a battle and it is not revived within three turns and goes to dust. Wild encounters cannot be fled or ran from. I must battle all lost golems that we encounter. Casino use is allowed throughout the run. Can we do this? Let's find out. I thought we were in trouble. Well, it doesn't matter. I took care of Hey, there's something here. It's a god orb. Baglungy. Some kind of material. Okay, well, I'll take that too. Oh, there's more coming. More of them. I suspected you might be under it. You are being attacked by those trapped here. I see. You seem, un I guess, a little. Whoa. Still, you are in. We're going back. Come on. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. You really? Hey, you said so fantastic. Good. Did you talk with your? Yeah. Yes, we did. We talked with the arm. That it's trying to do something good. Could resisting what the arm wants. Well, that's I. Even if the world goes without Toya. Only the young can achieve. I'm sorry. What I mean is, the old have to sacrifice Atsuma. What? You are doing the. Huh? I guarantee. Now he starts crying. I don't know. I'm glad. Now tell me, did you find any? Yeah, I did. Uh huh. God of. What? Well, well, boy. You know. Yeah, like he said. God orbs were created in man-made metal enhanced with magic to fight devil golems. Atsuma, allow me to make you a new weapon from it. A weapon? Yes. Magic forging is the Indeed, it will take some time to complete. Why don't you all rest? So now we've got a faff, basically. I can't remember what we've got to do now to advance the time. I think we've got, I think we've got to talk to the sage and like annoy him a bit. Maybe not. <laughs> okay, let's have a look around. Let's see if we can find anybody. See if any, anything happens. Struggling to get is better struggling together. Just the two of us. <laughs> let's check up here. And then we'll go down and bug the sage some more. There's Rygar. Where's Yuki? See what Riga's got to say. Yuki's in there, peeking. <laughs> and there's a shield. Let's talk to Yuki, see what she's got to say. Expensive looking stuff around here. Well, there's not a lot to do, so we might as well go and bully the sage some more. Pretty sure that's what we've got to do. So now, of course, once we've done this, go to grave keep home, grave keep home, do that bit of the story, and then um it will be god orb hunting time which i know where i think three of them are two of them are i'll have to check the third sage can i ask sage why are you in here i've got some questions go on then. i was wondering he said something about that arm of yours it's a weapon here we go it is a weapon after all this time created created to fight well created to circumvent the problem of death so Built with the correct, but why is it attached to me? Well, my, I'd say that you were found compatible, and it was attached at an early age. So, Xuma lost an arm at but some point. Why? Who could hope to gain by doing that? I have no idea, but I can tell you one. Whoever did it is quite a hmm. If I ever fought, yeah, good luck with it. I think you should get some stay. You're in the w I'm sorry, but this is gonna take until m then I'll watch until morning. No, no I'm telling you, <laughs> no, go get some sleep. It's like a mum telling off a kid. You're not sleep master. Seeing beneath the surface was always one of your few strengths. First bombshell of the last series. I know so much because I'm the fool who attached it. There you go. Asuma's arm was attached by the sage, and the sage is the whole reason he has that arm. 
De de de. Who does that to a kid? By the time I realized he was there, sickness had almost claimed him. His parents probably thought I could save him, but I wonder now. It let you used. Correct. I had a sample here in the tower, still alive. I thought yeah. maybe I could use, but perhaps if he had died then. This is this is dark. This section. Perhaps, but he is facing his destiny now. Trying to make his and our, even if part of him is artificial, is trying to overcome the distress. It's so there is no question he should not have been left to die. Don't look at your map. Yes. So maybe it was our to save him by transferring. And now here I infinity. Am. It would be better if he were dead. What did you say? That I'm a no infinity. I've never heard that name before. That's going to become very important later in the game. From the deepest. But the numbers do not match up. You were saying there was another? No one knows now. The existence of infinity has all but vanished from history. Whether he remains intact or not. Nobody, nobody knows. The weapons, here you go, bo Thank you. Iris Knuckle, Meteor Rush. If you find any other, I can make weapons for your companions, too. Well, it takes... I've activated the teleportation to use it. Thank you. Before we go... Well, okay, go keep home. What now? Thanks, my boy. Don't go getting yourself... Okay. Well, friendly now. Nidokuri met up with Yuki, met up with Riga. Oh, set the party, then get them back in. Now they put Marlin Clave in then. Yuki. Well, I just got nearly 2,000 health. Okay, so. I'm pretty sure the skill they already learned that. So we can just equip it. Um, maybe not. <laughs> okay, let's learn the skill then. Meteor Rush, which is basically like a signature move sort of thing. Okay, so we're going to equip skill. We're going to put it there. Mega Flare Wave there. No, where's the Flare Wave? There, and then we're going to put Mega Stampede there. And then the weapon. We can just stick it on. There it is. So, right, God Orbs. I actually have remembered there, I know where all of them are off the top of my head. The first one is that Golden Lost Golem, which I mentioned earlier, which is just down or down out of here. The second one is in the desert near Junk City. And the third is underneath the bridge on the way to Yokohama, the one that got annihilated. So we're going to have to go back there, but we won't be doing that, of course, until after we've done Grove Keep Home. We'll see. This situation, we might as well hear, and there is no reason to come back after that, so we might as well get it now. And then it's done and dusted with this one. And then once we've got them all, we'll come back and give everybody their weapons. And of course, back to some randoms. This is a heck of a battle, Jesus. Uh, um, okay. Ew, okay, yeah, this is a good one. <laughs> Gotta think about this. Uh, 1200 that Rita Rush does, that is insane. Um, do we want. I might as well get rid of that, aren't I? And we'll go back up. Mega Aqua Mist. Mega Drum Roll, and then. Oh, a slash. Yeah, we'll go for a slash because that's the healer. So, over oh, wake up it. See you later. Mega drum roll. Yes, it killed them all. Well, killed that one. Three hundred. That's fine. Marlin. Oh, Jesus! Screen's nearly rip. Well, I can do some healing. We're gonna have to. Uh, mega. Sh oh, right. Okay. Uh. Mega shot. Can I go hit if I move? Oh, if I move our sumo out of the way, um, Rygar can hit. I want it back. I think he's dead. No, no, it isn't. Not even close. She took her. The lights are. Well, it's dead this turn. Anyway, so there we go. Oh, combo as well. Okay, so let's go down the, the longest steps ever. 
Couldn't have just done like a ladder. They do like ladders in this game, so I don't know why they couldn't do it. I think it's just around this corner. There it is. Right, it's quite a powerful golem, and I'm pretty sure this thing's got an attack which does over a thousand damage. So we've got to be careful. Golden, gold squat. Yeah. Sage maid. You show me your power. Yeah. Because we're going to put all these into our inventory and synthesize them as soon as we can. There we go. Right. Uh oh. 1098. There it is. <laughs> Off the bat. Okay. So, golden squat. I'm pretty sure these are immune to sniper shot. So it's got, you can basically hit wherever you want, but if you're on the front row, you can, you can get hit for a thousand. So you want to keep everybody off the front row, ideally. But you can only hit straight, so if everybody's not in the same corridor, you can't hit everybody at once. So, well, Yuki's going to need to heal now, that's for certain. And what we can do is, so it be Mega Aqua Mist. And a Shake, and then a Meteor, no, uh, yeah, Meteor Rush. Meteor Rush. Okay, that should be okay for this round. It does look cool, that attack as well. Light wave. So it's moved back now. Uh, but I assume if he gets hit again on the front row by that attack, he's dead. So we need to move him back. Mega Flow Wave. Right, guys, alright, because he's got like a zillion health. Um, so we can heal up. And then I'm gonna try a sniper shot because I don't. Uh, I'm pretty sure they don't work. Um, let's try it. You never know. Oh, it does work. Okay. My good old mighty blow, giggity. Mega blade, meteor rush. Tiger cure dance and a mega shot. I think that could be dead. Yep. Yes. Bugger them all. <laughs> the SG Senator's on level 49. Sad god orb. Okay, we've got one god orb out of three. So it's next. We're moving on to Grave Keep Home. Back up the good old stairs. As everybody likes some stairs. No. Even though everybody seems to like ladders, but no, they choose stairs. For this little bit. Don't need a heal, to be honest, because we've not got a lot far to go. Up we go, some more stairs. We haven't got a random in a long time. Ah, as soon as I say that, hey! <laughs> Bloody must have heard me. Oh, God. Okay. Uh, oh, that's awkward. Slash. No, it's not going to kill it. Mega Stampede, it's gotta be. Because that'll kill both of them. Yuki's in a really awkward position. Mega Drum Wall and a Mega Aquamist. That'll do. Oh no! <gasps> oh my god, we are lucky! <laughs> I've only got three health ones left. Get rid of them, there we go, that's what I got. I'll heal him up. No blow. Excuse that, pig. Well, let's go in here, and then we go straight upstairs. The grave keep home. Okay, the teleport's in there. So let's -a go. So this is grave keep home. It's quiet, sad. Too. I thought children didn't mind it. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Maybe they don't. I'm not a child. So what now? Why don't we... Yeah, we need to find... Come on, then. It is quite like a mellow, saddish place, this. I 
I don't know where all these people live because there's literally only one house in this whole village. But, you know, but there's a chest down there. So we need to get that at some point. Don't seem to be able to get down. I think the way down is like right over there, just to be awkward. Uh, let's talk to her. Oh, I thought we always covered her. The other side. Let's have a nose in here. Oh, I see. Nothing in there, so let's carry on. I mean, it's, it's a very impressive gate. Whoa. Yeah, exactly, that's what I just said. Huh? You just got a cold. Got cold. They don't seem to be any exits. This must be the gate the sage mentioned. She did she caught that extremely quick. She 